Hey guys, it's Megan Heltz, and I know I'm wearing the same outfit as um, a couple of my other Etsy product review videos, but I needed to film a couple at once, so hopefully these will be broken up when they actually go up. But we're going to be reviewing Elemental Beauty. So uh, this is one of the brands that I reviewed while I was on my two-month hiatus. <laughs> so this is Elemental Beauty. They do mineral makeup, and um, their Etsy product name is actually like Pretty Pounders, but their real name is Elemental Beauty, guys. They are located in the Cranbrook area of the United Kingdom. So Cranbrook, United Kingdom. So really, really far away from me. I'm very excited about them. I cannot wait to tell you about them. They have a lot of interesting products. They have like healing powders and night treatment powders and mineral eyeshadows, mineral makeup, and they have so much stuff. What I was the most interested in was their their mineral blushes and like their illuminators and stuff. So that's what I'm blah, blah, blah. that's what I'm going to be talking to you about today. So I got to try two of their mineral illuminators in um, opalescent and rosy apple, and then the other one is a mineral blush in antique rose. I am wearing the mineral blush in antique rose on my cheeks, and these are very very pigmented products. Um, you. The, it takes some getting used to because I'm used to blushes that you build up if you want to. These you end up building down. So no matter how lightly I tap them, they're still very pigmented and very blendable. So I will dot some on and then I will have to blend it out across my cheeks with one brush and then I will use another brush to lighten the, the color a little bit more. They are so incredibly pigmented. I don't think I've ever worked with such pigmented blushes. Um, yeah, so if you've been looking for a pigmented blush, these are insanely pigmented. Let me swatch the one I'm wearing. It is called Antique Rose, and that is the mineral blush. It is so pretty. It is the kind of blush color that I really like, where there's some orange and some coralness to it, you know? I love that. Oh, and let me show you their packaging. So they have the sticker on the front that says Elemental Beauty. And on the bottom, it has the, the date of how long they last, and it has the ingredient list, and uh, it just tells you what it is. So this one again is Antique Rose, that's the mineral blush. These have sifters in them, which I really, really like. I like products with sifters. And let me swatch this, and again, you don't, you don't need much. These are insane. Okay. They are so pretty. I just did, I did barely anything, like, and I, you can really get a lot on there, and then you can really blend it out really nicely. See what I mean? And then you would blend it down even more from there. They're crazy. So this is a really pretty blush. They're very shimmery, and again, it just, it's just the perfect blush color for me. It's probably my favorite of the three products I tried. I really like that one. It's just stunning. And the packaging is really, really nice. It's really nice. Um, sometimes with sifters and like loose powders, you'll have some leakage or something, but these close really tightly. They're very nice. I like the presentation of the product. Okay, so the next one that we're gonna swatch is Opalescent. This is a mineral illuminator. Again, it is the same packaging with a sifter and everything. This one is much lighter pink. It does have some shifts to it. Um, if you know anything about fine jewelry or gems, you'll know about opals. Um, it is so pretty. It, it just is very, very pretty. Do you see it right there? It can work as a highlighter. It can work as a blush topper. I mean, it's so pretty. It's very light. It's a nice, light flush of pink. It's really nice, really picks up the light well. Again, um, these are pigmented, they're very pigmented, and they, they blend out really well though. So if you're scared about a pigmented blush, don't worry, because you can, you can work with them. They blend out really well. And then the other one is Rosy Apple, and that again is a mineral illuminator. Rosy Apple is definitely more of a blush looking pink, but again, It works itself out very pretty. 
it's a very like a nice flush of pink this one is more of a matte satin kind of finish and the other ones have more of a shimmer in them with opalescent obviously having the most shimmer so i really like these products i have been reaching for the when i've been wearing makeup i've been reaching for these blushes more than any of my other blushes i like loose blushes i like mineral blushes a whole lot mineral foundation sometimes will break me out but mineral blushes usually do not and i haven't really had any trouble with these my other like my breakouts i have have been cystic acne flare-ups from other things but these are really nice products they're very well made thank you guys so much for sending them all the way to me from the united kingdom which is amazing um, definitely, definitely check them out. I mean, they have all kinds of products on here, guys. Let me tell you about the prices. So let's just do the prices. Now, it is a little hard to kind of pick colors um, on here. That's the only hard part. I'm going to read you the um, descriptions. So, Antique Rose is listed as a rosy glow for fair to medium skin. That's the best seller and it suits all skin tones. That's why I picked Antique Rose because it was it says it's their best seller. And I was very, very excited to try that. And I am I agree, it's amazing. I can I can see why it's their best seller. So they have shades that they say are for very, very fair skin, all the way down to medium or darker skin. The opalescent illuminator is described as a beautiful iridescent glowing pale pink, and it gives you the celebrity look. And Rosy Apple is a glowing pink that can be used as a blusher for fair skin tones. So there's such a wide variety on here. I really like all of the ones that I got to try. These are $7.97. And on the back of the or on the bottom of my packaging, it says that it is three grams. Definitely a good deal for a lot of product. These perform really well. I mean while I may have gotten rusty with a lot of my other skills um, when I took my two months off of wearing makeup, I feel like the blush came out really well. And that was definitely not me. That's how good the product is. I mean, look at the, it's just such a pretty blush. I really like the blush. And um, again, these are great. I give them two thumbs up. I highly recommend them, especially if you just love blushes or you love mineral makeup. There's so many mineral makeup products on here that you can try. So thank you so much again for letting me review these products. I just really appreciate it. Um, I want to make sure I got your name right. Nicola, thank you so much for letting me review these products. And thank you for putting up with me while I was, I was on my break while I was reviewing these products. So thank you for putting up with me. I, I really appreciate it. You know, not a lot of brands would do that. Thank you so much. And, um, yeah, thank you everyone. Definitely open up the description box. Please check out their shop. Just look at how pretty their products are in their packaging and how interesting all their products are. There's some really interesting products on there. I really want to get more of the blushes and I really like the illuminators too, but mostly I want to get some more blushes. They're so good. So thank you guys so much for watching and this is Megan Helt out.